I got a few items from the burn pile that I'm going to recover the copper from. Some of the stuff you can't get the copper out of it unless it gets burnt off. There's no way to get it out of it. Copper is worth of money set if you're scrapping. Electric motors, wiring, transformers. Refrigerators got a little bit of copper in them, but not a whole lot. Water pipes. I get a lot of my copper and stuff out of renovation jobs that I help people do. Most of the people I work for, they don't collect the scrap. So that's just a bonus. I'm not afraid of a little hard work. Anyway, you gotta have some kind of hobby. My hobby is tearing scrap apart. I know it don't pay a lot. Sometimes it's not about the money. Cheaper to tear junk apart than it is to go for therapy. <laughs> Definitely won't get rich off scrapping, but who cares if I make a dollar? It's a dollar I didn't have yesterday. I don't care. Why should somebody else care if I waste my time? My time. I'm doing it to show you if you want to do it. What you're up against. It's not going to be easy. Sure don't expect everyone to scrap. Scrappers don't need that much competition, so... If everybody don't scrap, that's a good thing for most of the scrappers. Everyone scrapped, nobody have anything. Every little bit helps. I'm worried about how long it takes. I ain't, I'm never worried about how long it takes. Because I got so much junk to tear apart. I can't get in a hurry, I'm never going to get it done. If somebody don't do it, then no one's going to know what it's worth. Copper's two something a pound, 260, 280, something like that. Things, thing is about valuable metals, you never know what the price is gonna do. You know, it could shoot up to five or six dollars a pound unexpectedly. Can't read the stock market, you know? keep track of it a little bit. Might be worth 50 cents today, but tomorrow it could be worth two dollars. And if you got a thousand pounds of it, the best time to collect it is when it's low because nobody wants it because it's worthless. Eventually, the price is going to go up. If it was worth a ton of money, you would never be able to find any. Right now is a good time to go collecting it. Everyone don't want to mess with it because it's not worth it. Well, yeah, of course it ain't worth it. Right now, worth it or not, four or five hundred dollars is four or five hundred dollars. Yeah, some of the items, they're not worth a lot to tear apart, especially the miscellaneous items. But if I didn't take it apart, it would be worth less. Might be only worth 50 cents, but if I didn't take it apart, it's worth like five cents. I'd rather get 50 cents than five cents. In this day and age, you can't be afraid to get your hands dirty to make a few bucks. And when I mean a few bucks, I mean a few bucks. I don't mean a lot. Never, you can't be too secure with a job. Metals are always, people are always gonna want metals. There's still a lot of people that don't have good jobs and ain't making a lot of money to find some way to make extra income. Not everyone's got $30, $40 an hour jobs. I hate to break it to some of the people. 
Not everyone's got it like that. Me, I don't care. I don't care how much it pays. Even when I work for people, I want a decent wage, but I take what they can afford to pay. All you're gonna do with the money is go pay bills anyway. It's not like you get to keep it and do anything you want with it. Anyone that knows about scrapping knows exactly what I'm talking about. Someone that don't know, I'm gonna say it's a waste of time. Whatever. I'm not wasting your time, I'm wasting mine. See, I'm not afraid to get my hands dirty. I'm not afraid of a little bit of hard work. That's the difference. If I gotta work for a dollar an hour to make ends meet, then that's what I gotta do. Do I want to? No. Do I have to? Once in a while, yeah. Here's what I recovered from the items from the burn pile. Two and a half pounds of steel. One and a half pounds of copper. Turn on time from the items to the burn pile, 10 minutes.